Okay, hello everyone, this is a lot of sweetness here 2011 and in this video I'll be showing you how to create a torn picture effect in GIMP but first I want to tell everyone that I wasn't the first one to make this video uh, the actual first person to make this video was uh, I think by GIMP Tricks I think that's the channel name and so the credit goes out to her and all her videos but I wanted to make a video showing you how I go about doing it so let's go ahead and get started I've already opened up a new image and with your back with having a background color just pretty much emphasizes the picture on the page and you pretty much just paste a picture in a new layer as you see here now to get started tearing the photo apart. First click your free select tool and just pretty much draw a jagged line around through the picture wherever you want to tear it. Just like so, holding the left click button down and drag and connecting them back together. Now with that layer just like that, with it selected right click go to edit cut and then right click outside the selection over here and just go edit paste now you'll see floaty selection here just click then create a new layer and now you have both of these together first we're going to go back to the first layer the, what was left over from cutting it out and that would be this one right here now what you want to do is duplicate that layer once and click right click on that new duplicated letter and click alpha to selection now with your foreground color being white click the bucket fill tool and make sure your fill hole selection is checked and foreground color is checked here as well and just click inside that. Now what you want to do is slide the first layer above the background color and slide that above the white layer. Now go to the very first layer and click your move tool and just move it over so you can actually see what you're doing now go to actually click both of these eyes off the first layer and the second layer and now you'll just see this white layer here and click the white layer and click the move tool and click in the white layer and just move it over press, pressing the right arrow key several times and that seems good enough and I'll turn both of these eyes back on. Now with this layer, sport car layer here above the white layer, I'm going to merge those down. Merge down. And I'm going to do one other step and then I'll show you after I get done with this one, I'm going to repeat the steps that I showed you. But first I'm going to go to filters with that with this layer selected with the white and car layer selected that we merged down go to light and shadow drop shadow and leave everything at default and press OK and just take that drop shadow and drag it it's kind of acting up so and make sure that drop shadow is below the the layer that we merged together and you can actually take the both these eyes off and you'll see the drop layer here and with your move tool selected click the little you'll see the shadow effect click that shadow and press the right arrow key a few times just to pretty much emphasize that now 
now actually I'm going to step off here for a minute and finish the steps on this one and do just do everything the same that I just showed you and I'll get right back to you and if you wanted to you could merge the drop shadow and the cutout selection the drop shadow with the cutout selection and merge it separately to this one and this one and you could have dragged and moved it around but due to short time limit on YouTube because I'm not a partner which I'd love to be just because it's awesome and I love to try to get to that point but anyway that's pretty much how you create a torn picture effect in GIMP and thanks for watching everyone